We're here at Gotham City Games. Um, everybody, uh, another uh, retro store here in Brooklyn. It's on 84th Street. And uh, what's the cross street here? 84th Street and 5th Avenue? Between yeah. 5th and 6th. Yeah. It's on 84th Street and 5th Avenue here in Brooklyn. And um, a lot of nice things here. Good deals. A lot of uh, a nice assortment of, uh, of games and a variety. Picked up a couple of different uh, controllers. As you can see, there's a picture of a quack shot, a quick shot that I just picked up right now. Um, also, also, can't be retro without having some of the old wrestling toys here. You see that? It's really nice. Really nice. As you can see, all the different systems. Very, very nice. What do you think, Jay? <laughs> what do you think, Jay? So far, so good? There she is. What does she think? Nice. <laughs> Yeah, another uh, video game store here in Brooklyn. It's called Gotham City Games on 84th Street and 5th Avenue. Definitely, if you're in the area, stop by. A nice variety and assortment of games and game systems um, from retro to current. Um, you might find something. Definitely stop by, guys. Good stuff. Okay. We're adding it up. We're adding it up. Here we go. You guys don't mind if I ask you your names? I'm Joe. Joe, all right, Joe. This is Joe. He's uh, running the store here at Gotham uh, Gotham City Games. Well, the owner's Ralph, but he's not around. And the owner's Ralph. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> and you? I'm Lewis. All right, Lewis. Yeah. Thank you so much for helping us here, course, adding yeah. to the collection here for Rod Squad Retro Reviews. We'll do a more formal review of the store later on, and air it for you guys. Good stuff. Good stuff. Just want to take nice, nice little picture and view of the uh, whole store. I mean a lot of a lot of stuff here a lot of stuff here for uh in a small space but a lot a lot of stuff good stuff man good stuff good stuff good stuff support our local retro stores support our local retro stores i will always say that um without retro there wouldn't be no modern obviously but um Retro always brings me back to a time I didn't have the problems that I have now or the worries that I have now. But the best part about retro is I get to share it with my kids, the next generation, and they appreciate retro. So this is good, good, good stuff. There go Jay, looking at some stuff. Good stuff, good stuff. So what do you think? I mean, it's it's small. It's but small, but they got a lot of stuff. So if you guys are really just looking for retro, you should probably stop, make a stop here or Brooklyn Video Games or New York video games and all the stuff like that. But this is this is pretty nice. What do you think Arnold would think about it? You know, I think it's a good game. It's a good. Yeah, game. They got the stuff everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, it's it's small, it's compact, but there's enough room to move around. Mm -hmm. A nice assortment of things. The, uh, the the people are very nice. The people here who service you are very nice. They have uh, uh, they help you. They have uh, they help you with any questions that you might have. I really really like this place. Yeah, again, it's on 84th Street and 5th Avenue in Brooklyn. Um, please stop by. Again, support your local retro stores. Retro is where it's at. will always be where it's at. There will be no modern without any retro. So um, we'll give you guys more of a, uh, in depth thoughts uh, in a few minutes. Thanks. Hey, everybody. Welcome to another Rod Squad Retro Reviews. Um, we found another retro store. We actually, we've heard of it before. Today, we actually look into uh, on their online site. And what we found was. Um, we looked at their online uh, their online site. It's called uh, Gotham. Uh, what's it? Gotham City. Gotham City Games. Gotham City Games. It's on um, 84th Street and Fifth Avenue here in Brooklyn, Bay Ridge. And um, the people there were very nice. They were very helpful. Um, it's not very big. Just give you a quick idea. We're going to show you what uh, you probably just seen what it looks like in our video. Um, it's not very big. It's 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 pretty compact, but. They make they make the most of about of the room that they have there. Let's put it like that. I mean, they have quality things, a variety of things, um, and um, we found some stuff that um, you know I always love picking up accessories. Jay got himself a couple of GameCube games, so we just gave you a quick idea what we got here. I just picked up uh, an arcade stick for the Super Nintendo called the Quick Shot. I've never heard of this ugly. before. I've never heard of this before. Jay actually looked at it. He actually wanted to turn it's, it down. It's very ugly, but, but um, I definitely want to give that. This one I'll save for the end. We have Jason. Uh, Jay got a couple of games here. We got X Men Legends, X Men Legends Two, starting of the the Marvel Universe, the Marvel Ultimate Alliance. They all came from this. 
So check that out. Okay. I also have a uh, uh, fire stick for the uh, regular NES. So we're definitely going to be utilizing this with that top gun that we have. Mm -hmm. We're going to do that, right? We got a couple of action figures. They were selling them three for ten. You got a Magneto here. Magneto is crazy. Egon and uh, who's this again? Whirlwind. Whirlwind. Yay! Yeah, yeah. Very surprising. We don't have the game. We do not have the game. <laughs> Doc, the drums for Donkey Konga for the well, game. Whatever the game. If you guys know what the game's called, uh, <laughs> you can help us out there. I'm definitely gonna get that though because I, I love to experience, uh, we don't have different know. experiences oh. with the games. And then finally, this is uh, the Coupe de Grace. Uh, picked up. I've been looking for this for some time. I've never been able to win it on the eBay whenever I tried. I got a very good price for it's it today. The Capcom Fight Stick. The Capcom Fight Stick for the Super Nintendo Entertainment System as well as the Famicom. So I'm definitely going to have some fun with this because yep. we have a lot of fighting games for the, a little uh, too many but yeah. for the S NES. And um, again, it's called Gotham City Games, located on 84th Street and 5th Avenue in Bay Ridge, Brooklyn. Um, again, it's not very big. The room is not very big, but they do make the most of the area that they have. They have uh, quality games, quality accessories. They have uh, systems, all the different systems there, as well as um, as well as the, uh, uh, the the assortment of different games for the different systems. So um, we're definitely going to go ahead and start enjoying some of these right now. Um, hopefully, we'll get to making a couple of videos, um, just giving our thoughts on them. I'm definitely looking at I'm interested in this. This right here is my is uh, my coupe de grace i've been looking for this for some time but um again uh, thanks for watching guys really appreciate it check us out on facebook on our facebook page as well as those retro pages on facebook uh, the retro gamers hub retros gamers revolution you definitely will find us out there so thanks for the support as always keep it retro guys support our retro stores <laughs> so ugly <laughs>